Hello everyone, totally YGO back here again with another dueling book replay. Today we have my dearest friend Cody with 469 rating versus Snoopy DB with 511 rating. Uh, my friend Cody recently played this game. He said he was testing out a new list and he's like, I'm like, yo, let me cover this for YouTube. He's like, yeah, sure, I'd watch. I'm like, oh, you know what, I will. So Cody's a great player. I've not seen this replay yet, but he's cooking up the new spice. He's pretty good. He's top the remote regional, so in my book, that means he's great. He just won the dice school. We just missed that, so let's get started. So yeah, he wins the dice school. Opening hands are Nessie, Mothman, Burial, Sukinoko, Droll, so looking like Dark World, or Tear with like a big Danger Engine, or maybe like Orcus, I don't know. Versus Bonfire 1 and OSS for a Black Witch crazy opening hand. You can just lead with the Omni Negate. Uh, then go. So if he goes this, try to attempt a disruption, and as himself, same. Like the Bell Star, deciding to pitch it for this. This place Deception. Alright, I could Deception. Should the Fool probably? Yep. Pretty good. Add Sacred. Sacred effect. He draws on the add. Which is rough, so it's some way. He summons Sylvie. He probably just goes OSS send here. No, okay. We go moon first. Oh, yeah, because you can go like moon, Requiem, Engraver, Requiem, Equip, send the uh, Requiem. Oh, that's kind of cute. Yeah, I see what you're doing. Uh, I don't know if he's on Lacrima. Okay, he is on Lacrima. Recently, he's been cutting this card, so that's interesting. But yeah, he does get the extra body here. Uh, I'm sure he meant to dump it. Yeah. Perfect right. play, send it off OSS, very nice on Poplar. Oh, okay. This does mean we're not getting the Flamberg, though. Poplar plays the Snake Idea Bell, star. And Great will summon itself back here. Uh, um, maybe we're gonna see like a Make Sequence, Make DSUA, and on... I don't know why he wants to do this. He doesn't get to get this... Mm, without Flamberg, I feel like it's just... Make DSOA negate something, and then he can IP away the DSOA. And then he has follow up with. He has a lot of follow up, actually. Plus the bonfire in hand. Yeah, I guess if he lives, he just wins. Is, is that what he, we see him doing? Oh, he makes half. Okay. Nah, half would be good. Pass on half. He goes Geus. Oh, yeah, so it is Orcus. Geusu, probably pitching the harp here. Sending a Galatea, even though Azure like kind of dumps all over the strategy. Yeah, it goes hard. Probably gonna go for Nightmare. Makes a token. Is it an Epicon? Oh, it's just both players. Yeah, okay, so he gets a token here. This can be made into a Nightmare Phoenix if he plays that, which is kind of cool. He goes Mask with the token. Uh, that's not legal. It needs to affect monsters. Yeah, okay, opponent catches it here. Oh, opponent doesn't seem to be letting him take it back, so he's just gonna make it with the hat. I mean, I guess it doesn't- oh, I guess it kinda does matter, because you beat Dorka Shape out, but realistically, you'd rather, like, flip the Azu and so Galatea never hits the field. I guess it beats hard drawing? Nah, never mind. Uh, he banishes the harp, makes a link spider, so it's threatening, like, potentially Galatea here. Flip Azu has gotta be the play. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah, on link. Okay. Opponent thinks here, battle, punches over to Little Knight, takes two hundo, punches over to Token. Still a lot of follow up here. It's a little rough because he can't really go like Snake Eye Ash because he doesn't have a good ad. So he has to go like. No, he can still has to go Snash. You can just go Snash, no ad. Send it for Cop. No, then you. No, you can add. You can add the Oak just in case. Because you can still summon it from hand. Yeah. Make Dark Charmer. Take IP. Take a little on the. Okay. Ooh, you can take the Omni. That's kind of tough. Not too tough though. Oh, you just think it's summoned. Yeah, no, that's fair. This doesn't trigger since then I will hit the field, right? Yeah, that's on the small system. Uh, foolish. Banish another 
I don't know if all of that's quite convenient. Go Nessie. Whatever this Nessie hits, it's looking bad. Because I don't like no disruption. So it's a Mothman. Summon Nessie, they draw. Tough. Uh, Mothman both draw on Discord one. That's a good top deck, holy shit. Summon the symbol, probably go Galatea here. Uh, does he go for Crescendo? Or does he go for the Babel? He goes for Babel, okay. Nightmare, probably send like... Oh, Wand, okay. No, that works, I, I see why you go Wand here. Wand, probably summon back this Harp, wanna get it back in the grave. Yeah. Uh, Dingyusu? Okay. Ding some. Oh, I keep forgetting it has this. Yeah, I just put the nightmare back in grave. Oh, wand. No, wait, what? Yeah, wand's better. <laughs> My bad. I haven't played Orcus in a hot minute. Mask, okay. And you can summon back the ding on his opponent's turn. And then I can make a little knight too. Yeah. I mean, the fan is just like really good against it. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Yeah, that eats. Ugh. This, this is just so dirty. Summon Gyusu. Fenu try to banish the Babel, which definitely goes crazy here. He goes this, summon, foolish, ding, probably want to send the Fenrir. Yep, so much follow up though, because he's like engraver summon, which checks the ding gear suit. Oh, it checks the mask. Ugh! But, like, he banishes your OSS, so you have to go like grab Oak first, probably. Hallowed as Amina. Okay. I'm surprised, yeah. The fact he didn't just go... I'm surprised he never went to try to banish the follow-ups and he just pitched... I mean, yeah, there's this. But, like, he, there's no known follow-up. Is it just too risky, I guess? I mean, I can see why the opponent thinks this. Grab Oak. Cause like, yeah, he's just gonna send this for the Black Witch, and then he can summon it back off the Oak, which just goes hard. Yeah, this is looking bad for Kona. Oh, Drop Stroll. Okay, uh, this still looks completely fine. Uh, summon back and Graver, Requiem Equip. This... Yeah, they have to change the mask here, probably, with the dip. Oh, okay. Uh, Banish... What? Snake Eye the Abella Star. Uh, I mean, actually, there's really not much better. You could banish the Wanted to get a Wanted draw. But not really draw anyway, so that's gonna matter. This is coming back in end phase. I almost tempted to just say, like, get rid of, like, the SP, or, like, the Fenrir. Or sort of fl nah, you're probably just gonna go to it. I think you just lose. Maybe that was, that, that was what I called funny enough. Damn. Yeah, it's just that unwinnable. Right. Hallowed as Amina, send the Deception, summon Sylvia. Okay, this is on. They should just scoop here. Hita. Yeah, Flambear, Princess. Yeah, 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 you're just doing the LMTK. Is he gonna go all the way through it? Yeah. He's only gonna play it out. Yeah, okay. Siding for game two here. Cody, like, murdered him. It was pretty rough in that hand. Too. Well played, my boy. Uh, hands are Cosmic Wand, Allure, Ash Regained. Rough on the engine. This Allure is gonna need a hit big against Unicorn, OSS, Mag, Temple, Implum. I mean, this isn't much better, to be honest. I mean, the Mag's... In I think the Mag's gonna FDK this hand no matter what. Uh... Unicorn's also just, like, really strong. He's up whipping Gears, Dingusu and Galatea and Mask and Little Knight. I mean, Temple's, like, also really pretty strong against this deck. Yee. I mean, you need to always say, oh, but you have so, yeah, actually, you have, like, so many things to always send. I mean, that Ash is, like, pretty strong there. I think it's, like, currently Ash checks this entire hand. Uh, leads regained, allure darkness. For fuck's sake. Yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, 
oh, that's like insane. Because you got like Shiloh and pitch the hope, and then that hope gets you like so much. Because you're getting Gilusu off that, and then Gilusu sound like Nightmare with Symbol, and like, oh, yeah, damn. I was like, oh, it's gotta be like the best shot. Whoop! Yeah, you always get on a wonder one there. Could you just put it back? You draw another here. Oh, oh my god! Filthy! Oh, yeah, that's not right, Cody. Uh, you probably should just be imperming the, what's it called? The Galatea. The Galatea is like, stops like 90% of the disruption. Like, you could argue that since they, they drew two and then they just led with the thing they top decked off the weekend, which is like, oh, that must have been their only play. I mean, how fast did he do this? I'm curious. Did he like slam it down to the field? Because if he did, then like, maybe viewing Banish. Drew Gyusu. And then summoned it like 10, 15 seconds. I mean, if it's your only play, then I feel like you just do it faster. Yeah, I don't. I don't think the input I will really justify it there. Yeah, sh Shaylin pitch hard. Hard nightmare moth man. Yeah, go through the motions. Galatea put the hard match. Make apple. Magna target. Really? I'm surprised we did it like this. Like, I don't hate it. I don't know, I just feel like we should have gotten rid of the symbol since they've already got a put back the harp. I don't know, it's weird. I guess you can get the ding out of the grave with the choice you're probably searching off this, unless you're adding flambeard because he only put in a mag. I, I think that's fake, though. Yeah, I feel, I feel like it would have been better to hit the symbol here. I don't think it's bad, though. Uh, link to make mask. Think. Set a cosmic. The cosmic's kind of. No, no, not really. Uh, this unit goes. Damn it, probably just wins the game. <laughs> uh, main one. Especially. If he goes mag, try to clear this, he, he wins. But, like. Because he's gonna make too much. He goes temple. Temple's like really strong in this matchup because I mean Temple and I have to summon everything. Like the fact that he let this go most likely means he has nothing. I probably chain the symbol here, right? To bring out the ding. And like ding send what you play, so like temple. Because it's just like extremely rough. Because like now, anytime you summon anything, you give them full combo if they play Snake Eye Ash. Yeah. Like, that's which is exactly what happens. Yeah, he, he knows that he just he can make full void and can sacrifice battle. Yeah, now he symbols, he symbols for the ding. Speaking of, did you Magna Search, Cody? Nope. <laughs> you did not Magna Search. Uh, Temple 1, Ding 2. Cosmic. Oh, yeah, I guess the Cosmic's pretty good. Uh, buy Snake Eye Ash, even though like, we're gonna get to Oak. Uh, send the Nib, now this. Send that. Okay. Oh, yeah, that gets much. Uh, special Unicorn. Yeah, this. This voice is a. Little guy. Uh. What's he. F Typhon? Really? I feel like you just... Nah, I guess the fun. I don't think he's ever living, though. Send Temple. Really? Uh, no, he did this right. Because he just places Deception. This guy has to vanish, too. Uh, set Deception, clip Deception, send it off, always says. Ooh. Does he always team if he wants to put back it? Yeah, he always put it back. Uh, drawing a, a hand trap would be crazy. Yeah, what the fuck ever happened to Ash? What did he ash? I don't remember. What did he ash? I'm... We'll never know. Yeah, summon Oak. Oak, come back to Snake Eye Ash. We just scoop here. Uh, does he have anything? He has a nightmare for hope for a body. Yeah, he just scoops. Yeah, well, guys, we're going to see Snake Eye take it in a clean 2-0. Uh, shout out to my boy Cody for letting me upload this replay. I appreciate you, my man. Anyway, um, I'd say he played this pretty well. I mean, fighting the Magnus, so it's not great. He pretty much, like, I'd say something, he'd do it. He's kind of the go.
yeah, if you guys want to see more of my boy, just tell me. Uh, he's the, he's pretty cool. Uh, I feel like the Orcus player could have take, took us a few different ways, too. I think they didn't have to, like, play it the way they did with that first few days. I mean, like, their deck's kind of linear, to be fair. I don't think you should have ripped a Typhon. I think that's very minor, though, because you always win in this position. But yeah, uh, GG's. Uh, I'll see y'all later. Goodbye, everyone. Peace. Totally YGO, out.